That folk music that you play there, what is that? How do you call that folk music? <laughs> I think it was Studs Terkel who asked Big Bill Brunzi, did he consider his blues music to be folk music? And Big Bill says, well, I never heard, heard no horse <laughs> might have guessed it from that song. The name of the group we're featuring today is Dicey Riley. I guess you count that as your theme song then. That's the, the closest thing we can come to for a theme song. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, Dicey Riley is John McGoldrick. Welcome to the show. Thanks. Kevin Johnson, Tom Johnson, and on the end, Lou Timney. Thank you. Nice to, welcome to the show. Nice to have you guys here. So the, that song uh, sounded like it was about a, a woman who takes a little bit too much of the uh, imbibing. Yes. Uh, not that we at all uh, associate with those activities. We, <laughs> we are generally a pub band, but uh, we do appreciate that woman's predicament. Keep in mind, the instrumental was Teetotaler's Real. Yes, we, we followed up. We had to temper up. it a little bit. You know. We followed up with the Teetotaler's <laughs> Real. Very good. Nice, nicely done. That's that I guess would be uh, our signature style. We we try and find some, you know, old folk song or ballad that that I like to sing, and we try and tie it in with uh, a fiddle tune that Tommy learned in a session in New York, or some old bluegrass tune that Kevin used to play with his band, and we, you know, bring it all together. All right. 
Well, Jim Hennessy has been ribbing me to get more Irish music on the show of uh, Hennessy's in Morristown. <laughs> and uh, he has said to me on that subject, God invented whiskey so the Irish would not rule the world. <laughs> <laughs> well, then, since you know, Hennessy's been ribbing you, we won't mention that we play for his competitor. <laughs> <laughs> well, you just did. But we won't uh, say, yeah, we'll, we'll say where we play. <laughs> the, you know. oh, you want to give us another tune? You could say who you play for. Yeah, we play uh, quite a bit for the uh, Old Chabine, which is uh, a nice pub in uh, Hanover Marriott. Which is, uh, They did a good job of recreating an Irish-style pub. Uh, inside the Marriott. Beautiful. So, uh, Sounds you know. like a good spot for you yeah, guys. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah, good time. So what else you want to give us here? Uh, this, this one, we're going to do a medley from uh, Lord of the Dance uh, that Tommy's going to start us off with on fiddle. And uh, we're going to go into a actually a French-Canadian tune called Mouth of the Toby. And uh, it's one of our favorites because we start off sounding like we know what we're doing and end, in a <laughs> <laughs> end with a train wreck. <laughs>
say the name of that first tune was? That's Lord of the Dance. It's actually a, it's a traditional Irish tune, and it's actually a liturgical song. Uh, it's about Christ dancing with death. Um, but it's also been used in a number of other places. It's, it's known as an old shaker tune called Simple Gifts. That's, the, that's where I've heard it. Yeah, too. and it's also a theme that's used in Appalachian Spring by Aaron Copeland. So <laughs> listen to it. It's in there. All right. Yeah, it sounds really cool orchestrated. So. Cool. Yeah, and, and we were true about getting pretty out of control by the end. <laughs> you know, I'd agree there. But well, you sounded like you were, uh, had things going on, right? Oh, yeah. We're hanging in there. <laughs> But you did drop your guitar pick. Okay, this would be a good time to switch. Okay. Kevin uh, is the most multi-talented of the group here. Well, I don't and, know about uh, that. Kevin generally leads on mandolin, switches to guitar for a few songs. He's working on a few fiddle pieces. Uh-oh. He sings. Not tonight. He's not available. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Kevin advertisement. Well, thank you, John. I appreciate that. So Pam should keep him. <laughs> right. So where are we going? Rocky Road. Oh, okay. I don't know why you're staring at me. <laughs> I guess this I have is, to start uh, this one. <laughs> this this is a really traditional piece, um, and it, you know, it really features the baron and and the vocals. This is uh, a traveling song about emigrating from Ireland because of the famine. In Larry month of June, from me home I started love the girls a tune. Really broken hearts, so Lord and Father dear, kiss me, darling. Mother drank a pint of beer. Three from tears, his mother then off to reap the corn. Leave where I was born, come to stop the car. The band is lost, and goblins the brand the barrow broke. Rattling are the bogs, and frightening are the dogs in the road. He rolled to double and one, two, three, four, five. Hunt the hare and turn her down the rocky road, and all the way to double and whack for all the wrong. Mauling girl that night I was still in so weary stars in my delight next morning by the early took a drop of your to keep me heart from sinking that's the party's cure whenever he's on for three can see the lassie smile laughing now the while at me can you stop and set your heart a bubble and ask me was it hard the wages are required to lay in the spirit's air the rocky road to double it one two three four five hunt the hair and turn her down the rocky road and all the way to double it whack for all the wrong in Dublin Away, my spirits never fail and landed on the quay just as the ship was sailing. The captain at me roared, said that no room had he. When I jumped aboard a cab and found for Paddy down among the pigs, played some party rigs, danced some hardy jigs of water around me bubble and went off all he hit. Wished myself was dad or back or four and stayed on the rocky road to double and one, two, three, four, five. Hunt the hair and turn her down the rocky road, all the way to double and whack for all they run. Well, the boys of Liverpool, when we safely landed, called myself a fool. I could no longer stand it. Blood began to boil. Temper I was losing. Poor old Ernst, I, they began abusing her. Aim of sauces, I'm a shillelagh, I left fly. All the boys were nigh, and so I was a hobbling with the loud hooray. Joined in the affray, we quickly cleared away for the rocky road to Dublin. One, two, three, four, five. Hunt the hair and turn her down the rocky road. All the way to Dublin, whack for all the rock.
Nicely done. Thank you. Cool. We should tell folks how they get in touch with you in case they want to find out where you're going to be playing sometime soon. Or they might want to find out about your uh, compact disc soon to be released. By the time they see this show, it might be out there. It may very well be out there circulating. So you can uh, <laughs> get in touch with them by going to www, oh no, http colon backslash backslash Dicey Riley dot tripod dot com or you can call John at 973-927-7440 that's it 927-77-7440 in the 973 area code and you'll find information there about Dicey Riley and some goofy pictures of us and <laughs> <laughs> if you haven't had enough goofy pictures watching us tonight <laughs> So what are you getting set up to do now? We were going to do uh, Star Above the Garter. Oh, we were? Or, did you want to or do Pigtown Fling. Yeah, let's we see. let this, this is what we call uh, slicing and dicing. Slicing and dicing. We come up with a playlist and then we change it. <laughs> so well, uh, one of our only favorites. Only way to uh, do it. It's the only way to do it. Did you dig up my pick? Did I? Yeah. No, I thought you picked I it up. I handed it to you. OK. So you did something with it. I have one in my wallet. Yeah. So we're going to do uh, Pigtown, uh, which is uh, one of Kevin's favorite. Pigtown is a, is, is a traditional Irish song, but it was also played one of uh, Bill Monroe's favorites. <laughs> I don't know if it was a favorite of his, but he played it. And then we're going to go into a song called I'll Tell Me Ma, which is another traditional song. And uh, some of you people who are uh, Irish aficionados out there may know it. And then what are we going to finish up with? With a reel. A real real. Shannon Breeze, a real real. Shannon Breeze. A real Breeze. real. Right, we need Tommy. Tommy around to tell the difference between jigs and reels. Yeah, he knows all these, you know, <laughs> these uh, dance. And, and he can play them as well. <laughs> Something I don't want to play with, you know it too. But. That's right. <laughs>
Very good. <laughs> well, at least you didn't have to tune up in the middle of it. Yeah, that's a good thing. It's happened before. Unlike most of our pieces, we gather a whole lot of momentum on that one. <laughs> so tell us about this organization, the Friendly Sons of St. Patrick, that you guys met through. Oh, yeah. The Friendly Sons of St. Patrick um, is a group of men who are of Irish heritage and or affinity. You necessarily don't have to be Irish, but uh, they just like to get together and do Irish stuff, uh, which doesn't necessarily have to be. Uh, involved drinking, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> however, oh, no, their top of their list is the uh, Morristown. The Morristown. They are co-sponsors of the Morris County. Let's be politically correct here. It's the Morris County St. Patrick's Day Parade. Um, they co-chair it with the um, Irish American Association of Northwest New Jersey up in Wharton, and they've been marching in the parade uh, since the days when the parade was in Wharton. Um, and uh, one of the uh, past presidents came up to me about four years ago and asked if I would be interested in starting a, a session type thing at the meetings that are once a month. I said, sure, you know, let's give it a try. And I have a bunch of guys who came in. Uh, Lou was one of the first. And then we recruited Tommy. He came in. And then John was uh, sucked in. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, you know, there are a number of other guys who play with us there at the meetings as well. You uh -huh. know, we, we have a whole group of us, about eight or nine of us. Um, and then we decided we wanted to take it another step further and go out and play a little more. Cool. Well, we're glad you did. Yeah. We're, we're enjoying it. Cool. Yeah. What's on deck? Where are we going, John? Uh, star above the garter now. Okay. We're really slicing and dicing today. Let's go. Uh, this, this is a good one for, uh, for, Tommy for Bill, oh. who also goes by the name of Lou. <laughs> uh, Curly Lou Timney. <laughs> that was yeah! Great. That was great! That was his solo. That
All right. Ah. Come on, boys. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Well, we just have Quietest about... Quietest 50 uh, people I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> <laughs> we just have about two minutes left, so I forgot to check the time before, but now we know. Okay. Uh, so we'll do... Uh, Let's do... Um, leaving Liverpool. Leaving Liverpool. And Ralph, you want to join in on us? Yes, on sir. This one? Play a verse or... Yeah, okay. let's, let's do that. Okay. Thanks for joining us, Dicey Riley. I had a great time. Thanks. Thanks for sharing. Thanks for having music. us, Ralph. <laughs> <laughs> My pleasure. Take it away. Take it away. One.